Welcome back to Really Haunted Places. Tonight's top 7 ghost stories will take you to haunted places in Montana. The Montana Territorial Prison housed prisoners from 1871 until the 1970s, and in the beginning its insufficient facilities, overcrowding and poor food quality made it an especially miserable place to be. There were quite a few murders here as well as a huge 1959 riot. Visitors and employees of the museum have seen the ghost of one of the most infamous residents, Turkey Pete. Hearing strange noises and the feeling of being touched or even choked are also common. Fort Benton is one of the oldest towns in Montana, and the elegant Grand Union Hotel was built in 1882. Legend has it that a cowhand drunkenly rode his horse into the hotel and up the main staircase before the bar manager shot and killed him. There have been a number of odd happenings here, phantom hoofbeats have been heard on the staircase. Mysterious blue lights sometimes dance across room 202 and a male ghost in a long coat has been seen throughout the hotel. While Fort Peck Dam was being built in the 1930s, the town of Fort Peck was built as a temporary home for U.S. Army Corps engineers and their families. There were homes and other amenities built including Fort Peck Theater which was completed in 1934 so that the workers would have entertainment. Although it was intended to be temporary, the theater remains in use today for a variety of theatrical productions. It is said that the Fort Peck Theater is haunted by a male ghost who will manifest wearing 1930s style work clothing. It is common for people to hear the sounds of men at work when the theater should be empty. There have also been reports of apparitions in the dressing rooms from time to time. The Elks Lodge was a hotspot in its early years. During Prohibition, it was the place to go for drinks and entertainment, and rumor has it that Bonnie and Clyde once played cards there. There was also a suicide at Elks Lodge in 1936, and the ghost of a woman in a long dress is often spotted in the halls. An apparition has even been caught on camera coming out of a bathroom. Bear Canyon is such a beautiful setting that it is difficult to think of the area as one of the most haunted places in Montana. However, that is the reality. Several people who have been camping or hiking in Bear Canyon have happened upon the ghost of a little girl in a white dress. This might not seem all that scary in comparison to some of the other ghost stories coming out of Montana, but it is said that this little girl appears in order to lure females away from the trail causing them to get lost in the woods. Not so innocent after all. Virginia City might be a fun tourist town now, but it has a dark history of murders, hangings, and debauchery. The Bonanza Inn is the most haunted building in the city, guests have reported being pinched and poked during their stay, and anyone who slept in the notorious room one had a good chance of seeing a ghost. One of the most famous locations in Montana is also one of the most haunted places in Montana. We are of course talking about the Little Bighorn Battlefield. It probably goes without saying that this particular site is a prime location for paranormal activity. It is not at all uncommon to hear men screaming in agony or for apparitions to appear late at night. I want to thank you for listening to our top 7 ghost stories. And until then, good night.